okay in this video we shall develop from where we left off obviously and we shall develop the loops uh, in the last video we created the primary loops and now we shall extrude those primary loops and arrange them into more loops surrounding those primary ones right so I have started with the I loop and I have extruded on the top and in the bottom part and then I'm arranging the vertices uh, welding these two verti uh, vertices extruding these edges arranging the vertices uh, welding where it's needed and if there are gaps I would create polygons create polygons and that's how we go we extrude out new geometry and adjust them into loops surrounding the earlier loop, loop uh, sorry loops okay one thing to keep uh, one thing to pay attention is um, that uh, I have also provided screen grabs of this uh, process in the the address to the screen grabs is there in the description I have posted them in my blog and the address to the uh, address to the page of the blog containing on the screen grabs is there in the description so you can go there and look at the grabs and um, I believe you can continue without me saying anything so I will leave the studio on for you and see you later. this uh, now I'm applying the um, symmetry modifier and uh, very, uh, adjusting the symmetry modifier and here it has been placed
minor tweaks to the vertices and our symmetry modifier is in place. The next modifier we would be needing would be uh, mesh smooth. And sometimes isolation mode helps in being able to judge the shape. I see some dents there in the forehead. Let me come in and get them rectified the best I can do in the time given. And I believe I am done.